YouTube, how you going? I want to show you a little thing that uh, Troy sent me. Troy from um, Sharp Energy Investments. He had one of these kicking around and he sent it to me. He said, there I go Chris. You can read it upside down, you know, just turn your head around or whatever. Okay. Now that's a Bluetooth battery monitor. Now I've got a solar panel charged. Now that solar panel is actually too big for that solar controller in there. Let's have a look. Okay, can you read all that? I'm hoping you can, yep. Alright, so we've got a, um, oh, that's an e-solar solar panel. And the voltage range is right on the edge. Okay, for that um, projector charge controller. So um, I got two of those panels. So I got Silvio, they're a 110 watt panel. Um, I got a e-solar little e-solar charge controller, PWM charge controller on it. <coughs> now that'll let through uh, up to around 20 volts or something like that in the configuration I've got it set for. All right. Um, and that's plugged in there. So it's charging right now. If the camper trailer was on, it would be charging the car battery through the projector because that back charges both ways through the MPPT. Uh, so it would be charging the uh, car battery. This is a camper battery and it'll be charging the other batteries in the camper. Alright, now I do have, I am going to put solar panels on the camper as well. Um, but basically, uh, that's, that's, that's all working great. I'm just testing everything. Alright, there's the unit there, monitoring and charging. You can see the volts. It says charging. Um, now being a Bluetooth device, it says my battery's at 99%. Okay, that's great. Being a Bluetooth device and this being a metal box, but this metal box isn't totally sealed. It does have that rubber seal around the lid and where the wires go out through the back, it's got a great big uh, rubber grommet at the back and it's got a, yeah, where, where all the wires go out the back. It's got a big rubber grommet and then it's elastic on it to waterproof it all. Alright, so if you wanted to know your uh, cranking amps and all that sort of stuff, you would put this on your car battery and do all that. But basically I want to use it as a monitor for the um, camper batteries, which this e-solar battery is. Now these e-solar batteries, um, uh, if treated right, will last around eight years in a camper, okay, and indeed that he has, there are caravans out there that have these batteries in them that are eight years plus old. Um, maybe someone with a caravan can comment on that, uh, that uses e-solar AGM batteries. Alright, so let's shut this off. Okay, it's fully closed. I haven't locked it, but it's fully closed. We're still getting a signal here. Let's go for a bit of a walk. Now this is Bluetooth, so it hasn't got a very long range. But let's go around 10 meters away. There we go. We're at 10 meters away. Let's put a bit more metal between us. Let's put the rest of the car between us. Okay. And indeed, you can see the little red lines moving. There we go. Sorry about the... I've got one of those unbreakable screens on this thing and then it's got a plastic cover on it as well so the glare's a bit friggin awful. And of course this saves all that data. Now it's also got an alarm. Um, on it. Let me go and sit back over here so I can rest it on my knee and show you. 
Okay, up here, you click that. Daily power notifications, transmit one time every nine hours. Um, you've got power alarm settings. Okay, so we can uh, know what's going on. So every nine hours, it'll transmit a log. And if you've got it as a cranking um, battery, it'll also give you a, a normal cranking notifications if your battery's on the way out or you've got loose connections. I totally love it. Troy, that's the top bit of kit, mate. Thank you very much for sending it to me. All right, YouTube, sorry if the video's a bit long. Um, I just wanted to show you how awesome this little device was. Uh, the name of the app that goes with the device is got a V on it like that, red circle, V, and it's called Battery Monitor. Um, it'll work with your uh, iPads or your... Um, yeah, it'll work with a few different operating systems. All right. That's it. Keep safe, everyone. Bye for now.